Hello, welcome. In this short video, I will discuss the properties of the Bernoulli distribution. Bernoulli distribution is given by burn of x comma x given mu distribution with x as the variable mu is the parameter is defined as mu power x multiplied by 1 minus mu power 1 minus x. Here x is the random variable and mu is the mean of this distribution. Here x can have only two values that is 0 and 1. So the first property is that that the distribution has a total value of 1. That is, uh, for, for convenience, let us call this distribution P of x equal to the Bernoulli distribution. So, we want to show that for all values of x, P of x is equal to, the sum of P of x is equal to 1. That is, since x belongs, x has only two possible values, the summation becomes x equal to 0 to 1 p of x, which is equal to summation x equal to 0 to 1 mu power x multiplied by 1 minus mu power 1 minus x. This is equal to, when you substitute x equal to 0, you get 1 multiplied by 1 minus mu over 1. And when you insert x equal to 1, you get mu times 1, which is equal to 1. Hence, the area of the distribution is 1. So, second, the second property or second, second property is that the mean value is equal to the parameter mu. That is, expectation of x equal to mu and by definition expectation of x equal to summation of uh, x times p of x for all values of x. That means x equal to 0 to 1 x times mu power x multiplied by 1 minus mu power 1 minus x which is equal to 0 plus mu times 1 minus mu power 1 minus 1 which is equal to mu and the next property is the variance that is the variance of x equals mu times 1 minus mu that's what we want to prove so by definition variance of x equals expectation of x square minus expectation of x whole square. So, first let us determine the first term that is expectation of x square which is equal to summation x into, I mean summation x, x square times p of x which is equal to x equal to 0 x equal to 0 to 1 x square mu power x multiplied by 1 minus mu power 1 minus x. So, if you insert x equal to 0, you have 0 for the first term and then you have 1 and x equal to 1, it becomes mu power 1 multiplied by 1 minus mu power 0. So, which is equal to mu. And the second term that is expectation of x whole square is equal to, we already know that the expectation of x is mu, so this is equal to mu square. Hence, the variance of x for a Bernoulli distributed variable, for a Bernoulli distributed random variable is mu times mu minus mu square, that is mu times 1 minus mu. The final property is the entropy. The entropy of a random variable is defined as h of x equals so, I mean the, the goal is to prove that the entropy is equal to mu times logarithm of mu minus 1 minus mu multiplied by logarithm of 1 minus mu. So, that is our goal. So, by starting with the definition of h of x that is entropy, we have summation of 
negative summation of the probability distribution multiplied by its logarithm for all values of x. In this case, it becomes minus summation x equal to 0 to 1 and p of x is mu power x, 1 minus mu power x multiplied by logarithm of mu power x into 1 minus mu power x. So if you insert these values, you get, if I insert the values of x for that with x equal to 0 and x equal to 1, you get mu power 0, 1 minus mu, excuse me, this is 1 minus x, this is 1, and logarithm of mu power 0, which is 1, and 1 minus mu. And then we have mu power 1, 1 minus mu power 0, logarithm of mu power 1, 1 minus mu power 0. So this becomes mu power 0 is 1 and mu power 0 is 1. So then we have minus 1 minus mu, logarithm of 1 minus mu, and mu times logarithm of mu. So hence we have the expression for the entropy of a Bernoulli distribution. Thanks for watching.